Moving items in the Files app can be done a couple different ways, by tap or by drag. Let's move the Sample Invoice file into the Finances folder using just taps on the iPhone. So I need to tap and hold to bring up the options and choose Move. Then I can select from any folder or location in Files. I'll tap on the Finances folder here in Documents. If I want to put this in the 2016 folder here, I could tap on that. But I just want to leave this in the Finances folder with the rest of these documents. Tap Move and we're done. We can see on the iPad and iPhone the files in the Finances folder. Now let's move this from the Finances folder into the Project folder, but this time with drag and drop. So I need to tap and drag on the sample invoice, then navigate to the Project folder. I can either drop the file right onto the folder here, or open the folder first, then release my finger to drop it. We can also move multiple files at once, either with the tap method or by dragging. To do this with just taps, start by tapping the select button here, then tap to select the items that need to be moved. At the bottom of the display we get share, copy, move, and delete options. Tap on the folder icon when using the iPhone interface to move. Then we can select the location, just as before. Now on the iPad, let's do this with drag and drop. I'm going to go into the project folder and try to select all three items here. I'll start with this logo one file. Now when I tap on the old logos folder, I just like to select it, but instead it opens. So when selecting multiple items to drag like this, if you have a folder that you want to be included, select it first and then the other files. With these selected, I can navigate to another folder to drop them. Drag and drop can be used on an iPhone as well, but only within the Files app. On an iPad, I can drag a couple files and then close the Files app. Say I want to send an email with these attached. I can then just hover over the Mail app for a second and it will open. With another finger, tap the New Message button and drop the files in. Drag and drop from files also works in Split View. I'll bring the Messages app up in Split View and then drag and drop the same logo files into a message. We can also use copy and paste to move items either within files or into other apps. This will work with single files. We can't copy and paste with multiple items. So the Files app is really flexible when it comes to moving files and folders, which makes organizing everything in files that much easier.